Shalom, Shalom to the nation of Israel. Before we get started, all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rukhahakwadash. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. To the hopeful elect out there, scattered abroad, unlike unto a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David, 144,000 mighty men, peace, blessings, salutations, and to the remnant, men, women, children, shalom, right? So this your brother Shopper, man. So I seen this article um, two days ago, two, two days ago or whatever, whenever I seen it, two, three days ago, and so... You know, I put stuff on on my Twitter account so that later on I could go back and do a lesson off of it. And so I, I saw this. I read this article. They didn't bring out not one scripture. So when I go to go find it today, it's gone. They took it down. Because <laughs> in there, they wasn't talking about shit. They didn't read not no scriptures, no nothing. Christians do not understand the Bible. They can't even give you a straight answer on what sin is. So let's get into it. Yeah, I was like, damn, they can't even give you a straight answer on what sin is. <laughs> this ain't going to be long, Lord will it, man. This is not going to be long. It, they, they, it's ridiculous, man. 1 John 3 and 4. It's very simple. 1 John 3 and 4. For whosoever committeth sin transgresseth also the law. For sin is transgression of the law. Simple. Simple. Very simple. But the law by itself is not going to save you. That's why we are under grace. We need we need that grace. But let's let's get let's get build the build the lesson first. Let's build the lesson first. Romans chapter 9 and 31. Law willingness edifying. Romans chapter 9 and 31. But Israel, which followeth after the law of righteousness, hath not obtained the law of righteousness. Wherefore, because they sought it by faith, but as it were by the works of the law, for they stumbled at the stumbling stone. As it is written, Behold, I lay in Zion a stumbling stone and rock of offense, and whosoever believeth on him shall not be ashamed. So basically, the law was before um, Yahweh Shai came. The law was around before Yahweh Shai came on the scene. And so now you had um, people that were saying, you know, we got the law. We don't need to believe in Yahweh Shai. That's what they were saying. But then the scriptures say this right here. Let's get this one, Galatians chapter 2 and 21. Galatians chapter 2 and 21. I do not frustrate the grace of the Most High. For if righteousness come by the law, then Yahweh Shai is dead in vain. Yeah. So so you 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 um you can't just say I got the law, I'ma disregard Yahweh Shai. And you can't just say I believe in Yahweh Shai. Because that's what the Christians say. I believe in Jesus. So I ain't gotta worry about the law. You still got to rehearse the righteous acts. Let's get that. Still got to do your best. 5 and 11. Judges chapter 5 and 11. They that are delivered from the noise of the arches and the places of drawn water, there shall they rehearse the righteous acts of the Lord, even the righteous acts toward the inhabitants of his village in Israel. Then shall the people of Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, go down to the gates. Yeah. You got to rehearse the righteous acts, man. Because the Lord ain't give nobody license to sin. He <laughs> give nobody license to say, oh, well, Yahweh Shai came to die for our sins. Or how the Christians say it, white boy Jesus died for our sins. And so we don't have to worry about it. What is it? Was it 20? 20 and 15, I think. No, it's not 20. I got it backwards. It's a rock. 15 and 20. It's going to say, it don't supposed to be that many in that. <laughs> it don't supposed to be that many in there. 
Sirach chapter 15 and 20. Nineteen, And his eyes are upon them that fear him, and he knoweth every work of man. He hath commanded no man to do wickedly, neither hath he given any man license to sin. So the Lord ain't just cause, you know, you won't find righteousness by the law, which is um, sin. I mean, um, um, the law of sin is transgression of the law, and you won't find righteousness by that alone. He didn't give anyone um, license to sin. You can't just say, oh, well, I, I can't be perfect, so I can't, you know, I ain't called, you know, you got to try. You got to do your best. Now, here go, let's get this one, James. Because if you if you break one, so trying to say you're going to find it all through the law, you break one, you broke, you broke them all. James chapter 2 and 10. For whosoever shall keep the whole law, and yet offend in one point, he is guilty of all. So you doing everything perfect, this and this and that. Um, and that's uh, to you OT only Israelites. You keeping all of the law. You you think you got all of the laws perfect. And then one day a woman that's on her cycle, so she unclean. A woman that's on, on her cycle, you 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 shake her hand or, or she, do, she give you something, pass you something or whatever the case may be. Now you unclean. So you you supposed to go take a shower. When you unclean, you supposed to go, if I remember the law correctly, whenever you unclean, you have to go take a shower, and then you got to stay in the house and, and away from everybody and remain unclean till I think sundown, if I'm not mistaken. So, but just just that in, a, in itself, man, you got to... It's hard to keep everything perfect, man. It's hard to keep everything perfect. But do we void the law? No, we don't void the law. We don't make void of the law. Let's get this one. Where we gonna go? Let's go. Back to Romans. For sure, we gonna go back to Romans. And we gonna get three. And I think 20, then jump down. Romans chapter 3 and 20. Now watch this. Therefore, by the deeds of the law, there shall no flesh be justified in his sight. For by the law is the knowledge of sin. Sin is transgression of the law. But you have to know the laws to know when you transgressing it. Because that's when you sinning, when you breaking the law, right? Let's go. Look, 23. For all have sinned and come short of the glory of the Most High. Yep, yep, we all have sin come now, where is it, go, 28, therefore we conclude that a man is justified by faith without the deeds of the law, 31, that's the point I wanted, 31, do we then make void the law through faith? Yahweh forbid, yea, we establish the law, so we don't make void the law. Even though you can't, you, we just read in James, if you fracture one, if you transgress one, you transgress them all. So you can't keep them all perfectly. We are under grace. Let's keep getting it. Let's go. Let's get the, let's get three more and we close out. Let's get Acts. Yeah, sure, Yahweh Shai died for our sins. But that don't still give you license to sin. That don't give you license to sin. Let's go Acts chapter 5 and 30. The Most High of our Father raised up Yahweh Shai, whom ye slew and hanged on a tree. Him hath the Most High exalted with his right hand to be a prince and a savior to give repentance of to Israel and forgiveness of sin. So yeah, Yahweh Shai was raised up for, for us for forgiveness of sin. But Let's get, let's get, let's get this one right here first before we get that close out in Romans, the sixth chapter. Let's get, um, you know, 12 and 6. Ecclesiasticus, Sirach, 12 and 6. Straight to the point. For the most high hate of sinners and will repay vengeance unto the ungodly. And keep up them against the mighty day of their punishment. 
give unto the good and help not the sinner. So the Lord not dealing with the sinner, man. So you out here thinking that, oh, well, the Lord, though, you just said we can't keep them all. And we under grace. Yeah, we under grace. But you still got to establish the law because the law is the guidelines to let you know when you're going on, when you're transgressing the law, when you're sinning by transgressing one of the laws. So let's get this one back to Romans now. Close out here. Very simple. I ain't see none of these scriptures in that. That's why they took it down, man. That's, I'm telling you, that's why they took it down, man. They post their nonsense, and then the Israelites come for them, and then they got to they gotta change up, man. Let's go Romans chapter 6 and 14. For sin shall not have dominion over you, for ye, for ye are not under the law, but under grace. But we can't just throw the law, throw the law away because you're under grace. We read that too. What then shall we sin because we are not under the law, but under grace? Yahweh forbid. Yeah, you can't do that. You, you can't do that. You cannot do that. You can't say just because we under grace and we not under the law, I don't got to try to keep the law. No. The law hates sinners and he not putting up with that, man. Know ye not that to whom ye yield yourselves servants to obey his servants ye are? To whom ye obey, whether of sin unto death or of obedience unto righteousness. But Yahweh be thanked that ye were the servants of sin, because we all have sin. We read that in Romans the third chapter. But ye have obeyed from the heart that form of doctrine which was delivered unto you. Yeah. You gotta understand what you, you gotta understand that. The sin is transgression of the law. You're not going to be able to keep them all correctly. But that don't mean that you throw away the law and just willfully sin. That you got to do the best, man. You got to do the best that you can. Pray, ask the law for forgiveness, fast, whatever you got to do. So, yeah, so, yeah. So, with that one, man, I want to close out. But like I said, Christians don't understand the Bible, man. 23. For the wages of sin is death but the gift of the most high is eternal life do yahweh shy hamashiach our lord yeah so yeah so the wages of sin is death and it's very easy to see sin is transgressing the law the law cannot be thrown away but you can't say that you got the law and i don't need yahweh shy you gotta have them both man so with that one we gonna say all praises honor glory to yahweh by hashem yahweh shy by Hashem, Rukahakwadash, double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth, to the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike unto a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David, 144,000 mighty men, peace, blessing, salutations unto the remnant, men, women, children, remain spiritual out there, Kwam Yashirala, and the Bible Bible, Baraka Thumb family, Shalom.